Hello and welcome to the calculator guide video on the store and recall function. Don't forget to subscribe for future videos or follow a guide calculator on Twitter. In this video we're going to look at how to store values in the variable memory. The first value we're going to store is 2. Input 2 and then you want to press shift and store to access the store function. We're going to select the letter A from a choice of letters that we have here. There's no need to press alpha first, we can just press the button and that's stored into memory A on the calculator. The second value we're going to store is 10 and we're going to store this in memory B. Input 10 and press shift and store and then press B. Again there's no need to press the alpha key first. If I want to recall any of my memorized values, all I need to do is to press the recall function. I don't need to press alpha again with this. So if I press recall and then A, I get the value that are stored in there too. Recall B and the value 10. For the next task, we do need to make use of the alpha key. We're going to do a multiplication using the values that we stored. So press alpha and A times alpha and B and that will multiply our two values together. If I use the fraction button and then alpha A, navigate down to the bottom and alpha B, and press equals, I can divide the two variables. Look out for a future video where we use the stall and recall function to help us to answer some questions as well as using the quadratic formula. Don't forget to follow a guy calculator on Twitter or subscribe for future videos. That's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time on the calculator guide.